Okay, so I thought I'd make this um, video of a cool feature I um, discovered. Um, it's not new, but I discovered it and I thought I'd share some info on it. Up to now, um, no, I need to, to uh, give you some, uh, some extra additional information. I have uh, an LPG injection system in my car uh, on my Chevy Big Block. And it consists of um, an LPG tank. Uh, a reducer that uses engine heat to vaporize the um, LPG. Then the LPG vapor under high pressure goes into a filter. Uh, at the filter, usually the temperature and pressure of the um, gas is measured. And then you have injectors that inject it into your manifold where if the valve opens, it's sucked into the engine and fired by firing the spark plug. Uh, and I don't use a, a Prince ECU, I use a Mega Squirt ECU to uh, drive my system. It's uh, in my case a standalone LPG injection system. Now, stuff that's interesting to know, of course, is your map, your manifold um, absolute pressure, um, which everyone is familiar with. Uh, other stuff that's interesting is the pressure over here. That's the pressure in this, um, it's your LPG pressure. Uh, in the um, uh, hose going to your injector reel but it's also interesting to know what the pressure is over here because uh, that's the pressure the pressure difference actually between what's in your reel and what's in your manifold and um, well, it gives you information about your system and it's usually in the ECU systems the pressure you need to uh, set up now the problem I had if you use Tuner Studio is in the basic Tuner Studio you can only use a reading this is my LPG pressure reading okay I'll do that later uh, and this is my manifold absolute pressure reading and I wanted to know the differential uh, pressure so there's a custom channel editor add a custom channel I believe this is the one if you have the normally registered Tuner Studio version, you cannot go into advanced, so you cannot use formulas to add a new custom channel. So, should I or should I not buy the UltraVision of Tuner Studio? Something I found out, because over here I fixed it, I got the LPG system, it's a um, um, differential pressure reading, which tells me at what pressure I'm injecting the LPG into my manifold and I fixed it by doing this um, Phil Tobins from uh, FE Analytics well, the designer of Tuner Studio helped me uh, figure it out if you go into your Tuner Studio projects my project is uh, this one 77 GMC Suburban go to project CFG you can if it's not there you can just make the file it's custom point any and I have two things in there you can put your own custom formulas in there. I have two things in there. I have RPM divided by a thousand. That's the name for this uh, signal. And it's the RPM signal divided by thousand. And you have to put it in these, I know what these are called in English, between these uh, symbols to make it work. And I'll show you why. If you have um, uh, an RPM gauge, and um, you put in one, two, three, four, five, because you do not want thousand, two thousand, three thousand in here. You want these. It'll say in here multiplied by a thousand, and I thought it looked stupid, so I wanted uh, to have a reading here where I divided my RPMs um, by a thousand, and then give me this reading. So that's that's why I used the um, the RPM by a thousand. Uh, and then uh, over the, um, the reading, because you'll get an RPM digital reading here of 1 up to 5, which is of course stupid, because you're not making 1 to 5 RPMs per minute. So over here I just use the normal RPM signal. The other formula I uh, added is the LPG system pressure is... Um, oh, this one's not correct. <laughs> These have to be the other way around, because the, the pressure is of course sensor 4, which in my case is, um, I'll paste it and then I'll go minus the map. 
your LPG pressure will of course be higher than your manifold absolute pressure and your LPG system pressure, so your injected pressure is of course the pressure measured, it's sensor 4 in my case, measured at the filter, so it's the, the exiting pressure of the reducer, I'll show it in the, it's this pressure, and you subtract the pressure in the manifold because that's the pressure that's left here which is used for injecting and it will tell you um, the injectors here the, their performance is quoted based on this pressure on, on how much injection pressure you have um, so this formula fixed that it's sensor in my case sensor 04 minus map and it'll give me the LPG system pressure so I'll save this now <laughs> actually made a mistake and that's the, if I go into designer mode and then go into dashboard designer, properties dialog, you can see here I use the LPG sys for that reading and for the TAG I use the RPG divided by a thousand reading, I oh, need to put that on the right spot and then for the digital TAG reading I just use the RPM reading. So I, help, I hope this helps others. Um, design a, a, a better dashboard that suits your uh, abilities and it shows that uh, the Ultra of course has all kinds of extra nice features of um, Tuner Studio but you do not have to buy the Ultra version to use uh, formulas like this to modify your dashboard. So enjoy! <laughs>